want your house back? Take it! January 6th, so many, we've been talking about this for months now, so many still in custody, even though they didn't hurt anybody, they didn't break anything. Some are facing many, many years in prison. A lot of this seems very unfair. A lot of this seems like political persecution. Tomorrow in Washington, D.C., at the Capitol at 1 o'clock, there will be a rally in support of those being held. Uh, the group running this, uh, uh, this demonstration, they're calling them political prisoners, and quite frankly, I agree. I'd like to bring in Kara Castronova. She is the co-founder of Citizens Against Political Persecution. She's one of the organizers involved in tomorrow's demonstration. Look, uh, you know there's going to be massive <laughs> security down there. You guys have all the permits, right? You've been in coordination. This yes. is a totally legal demonstration that you're holding, correct? Yes, we have had the permits for months now. We're working with police. Uh, we have a lot of security, really good security team that are also former police, former military. So everything is going to be secure. Um, I, I know that the news has been very worried and people have been very worried about this, but I think that tomorrow should be pretty smooth. I'm not here telling people to come. I just would actually rather tell people to watch tomorrow, to watch and, and check it out because we're going to be doing a demonstration and giving some information to the American public that they might not have known before about what really happens on January 6th. And we're also going to educate them on the political prisoners that are still being detained in Washington, D.C. as we speak, a lot of them in solitary confinement and without bail. All right. So number one, how can you watch? Because a lot of the fake news won't be covering this, as you know, they'll or they'll only dwell on anything negative if it happens. So uh, right. is there a YouTube? Is there a live stream? Is there a rumble? There how will be. Yes, there, thank you, Greg, so much. for the, There will be a live stream. It'll be up on my citizensapp.us. That's www.citizensapp.us. And you could watch there. But from what I understand, there is going to be a lot of media there. We've been contacted by a lot of media. Obviously, they're out looking for blood. Um, unfortunately, they're probably not going to get it, and they're going to be disappointed, and they're going to be forced to actually listen to us speakers. And yeah. hopefully, they'll be fair, and hopefully, they'll report what we actually have to say and give the American public the information that they need to hear pertaining to January 6th and what our investigative committee has found out. Kara, I have to put this uh, uh, comment up from President Trump. He spoke with the Federalist, and he said this. Put it up on the screen, please, and we'll read it. He voiced reservations about uh, Saturday. On Saturday, that's a setup. If people don't show up, they'll say, oh, it's a lack of spirit. And if people do show up, they'll be harassed. Uh, quite frankly, I kind of know where he's coming from on this. I have my own concerns. I want everybody to be safe. Um, how do you respond to what the president said? I'm just said everyone pray for us. You know, I'm going as a speaker and I'm going to do my job, which is to get up on the stage and, and, and speak. Um, I understand people have qualms about going to protest. Um, it's sad that in America that people have to feel that way. Uh, you know, like you were showing earlier in your show, the Capitol Police uh, that were uh, with Nancy Pelosi's January 6th committee. I don't want to see them tomorrow. You know, the Capitol Police make me more nervous than counter protesters, to be quite honest. That's what's given me the most anxiety this week. So yeah. I can understand that people are fearful. I could definitely understand that I'm going to go anyway because I have a job to do down there. Kara Castronova, co-founder of Citizens Against Political Persecution. We thank you. Good luck. Be safe. Thank you. And uh, I hope it's a successful event. I, I'm Thank sure you. Thank you. God is with us, as always. All right.